Today we're going to be opening six packs from the newest set, Silver Tempest. The set doesn't come out to November 11th, so we technically have them a little bit early. So we're not going to waste too much time. I'm really excited about having these packs. We went to a pre-release. Um, I'm sure you probably already saw that video. If you haven't, go back and check it out. Pretty good video as well. But the first pack right here is a Lugia pack. Now, these are some of the ones that were left from the pre-release itself. So we ended up with a few more to open on the channel. Now this set, I actually didn't think we were going to get until it actually came out, but fortunately we got lucky enough and was that three or four? Yeah, that was, that was four. And we ended up with some, so let's see. We'll take a little bit slower just so we can actually look at the artwork here. So the first one's going to be a nine tails. Well, Lord. Uh, do you should, which I can never say that one either. We got a Growlithe right here. A P I almost said Pichu. A Pikachu. Petalili. Tokodomaru. Halucha. Then we got a Esper. Reverse Hollow. And this is actually a knitted one. I love the knitted ones. So that's super awesome. I have a little bit of a collection of them. So I will definitely add that one to it. I think there's an Alteria coming out too that's going to be coming here pretty soon and our last one is a talon flame so no hit off the first one but we will take it well we will take anything that comes out of the set currently because it is not out yet and that is awesome that we can actually open some beforehand we've been pretty lucky so far with the last several sets in that sense that we get to open it a little bit earlier ahead of time not by a crazy amount of time but you know a little bit of time is good and I'm not sure if the codes are actually working until Friday so if they don't work it's because it's not out yet cool. now if they don't work afterwards it's probably because somebody already redeemed them and our first one is a nine tails again I think the first one the last one was a nine tails we got a leafy camel poncho I won't read them here if you want to pause and look at any in particular definitely go ahead and do that we got a crow gunk Solus, a Zubat, this artwork, okay, yeah, I was gonna say it's by that one artist, I can never say his name, but it looks very, he has a very distinctive style. Elgium, Elgium, Fun, Fungus, yo, check out this Alteria, that is epic, I was just saying there was another Alteria, not this one, but there is one that is a knitted one or a crocheted, I'm not too exactly sure of the style, but this card is beautiful guys, check that out. Super super nice, I love this, this is, this is super awesome. Okay, and our last one is a Zeraora regular rare. That's, uh, that's epic guys, that is epic. Oof, oh, where'd that other one, no, well, that is the reverse hollow, so this one be this one. Okay. Getting to the halfway point of this video real quick. We have a another cool card. There we go. And those those trainer gallery sets, you know, they definitely help these sets out. Because sometimes we got a lens right here. Sometimes if you get a bunch of regular codes, then it can uh, be kind of sad. We got a clang. Sandy Gas, Relican. We have another Halucha, Rufflet, Bullpix, nice, and a Reverse Hollow Zero Aura. There it is. And the last one is a Incineroar, regular rare. Nice, nice, nice. We will take it. Okay, moving on to the next one. Bullpix, what do you have? Are you hiding a Bullpix in there? Yeah, nobody pulled our nobody pulled a Lugia all dart at the pre-release, so there's still there's still hope here. There is lots of hope. Let's see. Starting off that psychic en energy, we got a Serena, which doubles almost as a bosses. We have a Lapony, Braxton, Rogan, Beldum. Love the crystals. Anytime I see anything with crystals in it, it reminds me of the Crystal Guardian set. 
Spinarak, Finnick going into a Feebas, and our reverse is a Rogunt, Reverse Hollow, and our rare is a Sui and Arcanine V. Check it out guys. Okay, so we did pull another V. That is pretty awesome. I would like to see a regular Arcanine V card. I don't think there's one out there, so. The Hussein one is cool, but I, I like his regular form a lot more, so hopefully we do end up seeing one. But we will we'll take this one for sure as well. And actually, as often as you like during your turn, you may move fighting energy from one of your bench from one of your other Pokemon to this Pokemon. Okay, so that's pretty interesting. Let's see, there goes that. Second to last pack. Second to last pack. Let's see what we get. Be really cool to get some sort of full art or alt art or something along those lines so hopefully maybe just maybe we can pull it off if not it'll be okay if the set's not out so it'll be plenty of time to get around to that kind of stuff we got arachnid stone Journer. whoa okay for feral thorn I don't, I, it took me a second to actually make out what was going on or where the Pokemon was at, but he's, he's right here. We got a Ponita, Venonet, Dewpider, Spinda, another Feebass, going into a Archeops. We will definitely take these. These are going to be super good, I think. I played this in my pre-release and it was really good, so hopefully they, uh, they, stay, they stay pretty good. And our last one is a Clink Clang Regular Rare. Okay guys, here it is. Drum roll. Last pack. Let's see what we get out of our last pack here. Like I said, we'll keep this one short. Nothing crazy, but just, just a little bit of Silver Tempest. There's that code card. Four from the back. Starting out with that V-Star marker. We got a Leafy Camel Poncho. Palafin. Matang. Noibat. Snow Runt. Sandile. Finnick. Yeah, Finnickin. Sorry. Macro. Going into a Lance. Reverse Hollow. And our last one is Keldeo Regular Rare. I do like Keldeo, so we'll take that. And that was pretty much it, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Take care.